So let's now test our application. But before I do so, you need to uncomment these two lines because you want to train your uh, your chatbot. You can either uh, train your chatbot using the corpus um, class, or you can simply use the you can simply use the list trainer if you don't want um, to use the uh, the corpus class. But by the way, this one is going to take a lot of time. It's going to take a lot of time because obviously it's going to train your chatbot on uh, a lot of data. So you need to save once you you uncomment once you have uncommented uncommented the, these two lines. You need to save, and then you need to run your application. And they have already executed my file because it's going to take a lot of time, as I told you, as you can see. It's going to uh, train your uh, chatbot with all of these data, and then it's going to deploy your application on your uh, local server. As you can see, this is my local server. So let me head on, head on, uh, head on to my uh, browser and show you the result. So let's now test our chatbot. Let me send a message. I'm going to say, how are you? How are you? And then I'm going to click on send and it will be sent. And then I'm going to uh, be waiting for a response. Here it says I'm just an uh, artificial intelligence. And by the way, it takes some, some time to get this message because we are making a request to our server and we are uh, waiting for a response.